Okay, this is an overhead light. And this side is here. And it has two little tabs that came out. A sliding switch. Okay. And the light bulb is this one. Okay. And it was not working. So, let's see. So we need to change the bulb to see if it's running. Or test the circuit. Because the circuit could be out. I don't know. So I got this bulb grease stuff, which the auto parts guy suggested for a couple dollars. Seals and protects all electrical connections. And then the bulb that went in there was a match to this bulb. From what the parts guy said. Oops, I just lost it. And this is an LED. The other bulb is about four or five dollars. This one's about eight. And it says it malfunctions to take it out and not use it. So we're gonna slide this in there and see if it'll run. As a rule, you're not supposed to touch light bulbs or battery ends because they go bad with hand grease. But this one, I guess, there you go. And this will be the side that has the light on it. And so he said to put a little of this grease on. And this stuff, you just save it in a Ziploc bag with the whole package. Just throw it in a Ziploc so you can use it again. So I'll go up into this good guy in here. You learn something new every day. I don't see a positive or a negative on each side, so I guess it doesn't make a difference. Turn this over. Let's put it in the hole first. And then put this one up. Let's slide it in. Put it in this hole first. And then you pull the tab. Okay, so it's in. Let's see if it'll run. Yeah, that's the car on, I think. Let me turn the car on and see if it makes a difference.
Nope. Which that unit's not working, so maybe the circuits will need to check the fuse boxes next. Alright, so there you go.